Green Touch is getting its final fifth year in order to achieve its bold and ambitious goal of improving energy efficiency in communication networks by a factor of a thousand. And today we have some exciting and new developments to share. Today we're demonstrating two new technologies in wireline networks that reduce the energy consumption in residential and enterprise networks by an impressive 46%. If these two technologies are deployed in today's networks, they will reduce the power consumption by 924 megawatts. This is equivalent to the electricity consumption of 2.3 million average households, is also equivalent to the annual greenhouse gas emissions from 1.2 million passenger vehicles. Last year, GreenTouch announced its Green Meter Research Study, which measures the progress of the GreenTouch Consortium towards its five-year goal and the impact of the technologies being developed by GreenTouch. Overall, we project that the energy efficiency in future wireline networks can be improved by a factor of 400 to 450, while supporting future traffic growth. Today, we're very excited to announce that the two technologies being demonstrated already improve the energy efficiency by a factor of 44. The consortium's task is really important in an ever-increasing connected world. We have more devices, more applications, more real-time uh, streaming. And that puts a massive demand on our communication networks. And hence, a dramatic increase in energy consumption. And this will happen every year, unless we do something on energy efficient technologies. Our work is creating breakthroughs that support this ballooning network traffic growth without dramatically increasing energy consumption, and therefore energy cost, and therefore the expense of communication service providers. And this will actually be beneficial for you and I, for consumers and enterprises. I remind you that communication networks have been designed without energy efficiency in mind in the past. Here is where GreenTouch comes into play. We develop and design new technologies, protocols and architectures that take into account both network performance as well as energy efficiency. GreenTouch is proud to announce a new low-energy optical point-to-point -point link technology. The access network, used to deliver high-speed broadband services to homes and businesses, is a major energy hog among all wireline networks and therefore is a key priority for GreenTouch attention. Demand for services of all kinds continues to boom. Services such as video streaming, cloud computing, machine-to-machine -machine, and the Internet of Things. We anticipate the ongoing steady growth of optical fibre based access network technologies for homes and businesses. This technology is designed for two key uses. Firstly, in the business sector, a point to point high speed broadband access and in premise network that would provide secure, low energy, dedicated services to enterprise customers. Secondly, in the residential sector, we expect in the future there will be a high demand for in-home point-to-point links that would be used inside homes to connect home electronic gear, such as internet TVs, wireless routers and the like, to the in-house wide network. In terms of optical transmitter and receiver equipment, this innovation will provide a 30-fold increase in energy efficiency compared to today's state-of-the-art optical transceiver technology. The energy efficiencies are the result of an innovative hardware design with a custom-built optimized ASIC chip. Additional energy efficiencies can be achieved through optical powering algorithms that are adaptive to the actual transmission rate. The impact of such a single device is quite remarkable. For example, when applied to the in-home networking scenario alone, this new optical transceiver will reduce the overall power consumption of the entire wireline access network by 27%. This translates to over four terawatt hours of electricity saved or about 600,000 cars off the road. This is important, as access networks are the most price sensitive part of the telecommunications network. Now this project has been a collaboration between GreenTouch, Alcatel Lucent Bell Laboratories and SEAT based at the University of Melbourne. This technology will provide significant benefits to businesses, internet service providers and consumers in terms of power savings and also overall network power reduction. Most connected homes rely on a specific equipment, the home gateway or the set-top box. 
These boxes allow customers to access Internet through a set of dedicated services. Multimedia, data, voice, television, all these streams go through the home gateway. Today, this equipment is always on 24 hours a day and it consumes a lot of electrical power between 15 to 30 watts, idle or not, used or not. So what if we moved all these boxes to servers in the cloud while creating new virtual home gateway, making service easier to be controlled by network operator while reducing energy and complexity? Hundreds of thousands of boxes could be replaced by a much smaller number of servers, more control and less energy. In addition to virtualizing these boxes, we've developed a new distributed architecture for the servers, which allow even greater energy improvement. This architecture allows us to shut down some of the servers during slow times, thus conserving power, and then turning only servers back on when CPU intensive application or bandwidth intensive activities, such as HD streaming, are required. This allows a more efficient sharing of the resources and lead to a reduction of the power consumption by the residential access network by 19%. Without any additional changes or other technology improvement, we could save about 330 megawatts of electrical power or 2.9 terawatt hour of electricity on an annual basis. This is the equivalent of 800,000 typical households. We are thrilled with these developments and yet there are many more gains to be had. As we move forward toward our five-year goal in mid-2015, Green Touch will be issuing more announcements on new technologies that improve the energy efficiency in communication networks. These include innovations in wireline networks, wireless access, as well as core networks. <laughs> <laughs>